Hello everybody, and today I am back to make 8,000 followers arena on the chess. Yeah, recently we had 8,000 followers on Twitch, which I thank everybody very, very much. Thanks a lot for the follows. And yeah, today I'm gonna do arena, which starts in 10 seconds, and let's go. Very much. Thanks a lot for. Hey, Karma. Good luck. Yeah, you too. I did my daily puzzle and failed it, so I'm well prepared. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Okay. And my first opponent is going to be... BLG125 uh, Let's turn the volume up Okay London in the first game, I mean it's like Jabava London Here. Let's see, five. Like, I'm kind of familiar with this position, so hopefully, I won't lose it very quickly. Uh oh. That looks very scary. <laughs> it plays it. E. I think I might have to go for content. Yeah, definitely not the scene I wanted. Uh, but yeah. Otherwise, position was awfully lost. If I move my knight, queen h7 is there. So, okay, rook d5. Oh, that's nice. Here. I mean, I don't know. It looks very bad. Yeah, B3, I don't know what to do. I sure go not. How are you? How about in this? Oof. Uh -huh, okay, it takes. Yeah, it looks rough. But it's getting close to time trouble, so maybe some swindles. Bishop C4, I'm not sure how can I swindle this position. Now, why would I move? Yeah, this guy is absolutely insane. I probably played awfully. Wow, rook a6. It doesn't give me like any chances. It's insane. And mate. Wow, this guy played so well. And also again, blg125. Hey, panda, thanks. Wow, but this guy destroyed me. So crazy moves. Wow, I gotta give this guy credit. That was insane. Probably I went for not the best opening I could, opening I could, but he played like two nil nil. Let me quickly check. <laughs> yeah, but guys, 
It's really nil nil. I played awfully. I, I really did. I did I was really unfamiliar with this opening. But opening, but yeah, my opening played so perfectly well. It's insane. Alright, let's see when will I get my second opening. Okay. So we can play against Book 11. That's my first time ever against him. Let's go. Nice. So let's go D4, C4. Here. Wait a second. Be careful with the knight. Uh oh. Book him under a knight. Oh, he has pre moving. Hey, my spurs. Pookie is literally pre-moving everything. Wow. Might be five. Hmm. I think I'm gonna take. Tornia. Just for chill chill vibes, you know? Just to have fun. Because rated tournament requires you to concentrate so much. But unrated you can just chill. And yeah, basically have fun. Maybe sometimes go for crazy content, you know? Like I did in previous game, which wasn't best. Uh, but yeah. Unrated tournaments are very fun for for friendly kind of stuff. Let's play a6. Yeah, Pook is actually holding quite well. b4. Because when you are playing rated, yes, it feels so nervous. And here we can just chill. So yeah, a7. And then I think I should take his rook. I think actually the best move is rook c8, then rook a8. So rook a7, I don't eye his 7th rank. So if I would be him, I would play rook c8. Even though position is still totally lost. Somebody wants to join the team. Sri Noi Mighty 2012 from India. Welcome. And yeah. I think I should get the dub. Queen d8. Queen d4, queen d4, queen c6, queen c1, rook d5, queen e3, queen g5. Another game for key11. Alright. Good game. Mm. Wait a second. Wait a second. Wasn't, uh, wasn't, wait, e4. Somebody wants to join the team. Wait, e4. Tell him was missed e4. Twice! Yeah, good game, Pookie. You played very well. Telmus miss E4 twice. Oi, oi, oi. Uh, Bardic01, welcome to the team. Aye, aye, aye. Yeah, GG, Pookie. How are you doing, by the way? Let's see. I'm playing against Quetaval. With white again. I pre moved. Yeah. That was unfortunate. And let's go for London. Maybe five. Oh no, I mean near to exceed, I think. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Take e3 and then bishop d3. Hello, Bunkinator, how are you? Takes, then castle. I had two castles, otherwise it would be made. Probably had other moves, but yeah, still. I like rook a1, c4. Mm. Ah, rook g5, I gotta be careful. Or rook h. Rook h5 isn't that scary, actually, I don't think. 
I think if this queen d5, I'm fine. Queen d4, there is f3. Rook g5 would be scarier because rook g2, queen g4, queen f3 is an idea which is perpetual. So I would have to go like f3, I guess, and c, yeah, it would be quite unpleasant. But this, I'm training queens off, and slowly but surely, I think I should be winning. Ooh, I'll take and get the open c file. Uh, takes here. Uh -huh. Let's play a4 so it doesn't have b5. d5, e5. Here, g5. It's, it rhymes very well. Uh, king d3, I can just afford to wait. After d5, perhaps even take. So e5, no, e5 actually maybe just draws the game. So I think I should take b3 or h3. I don't think there is a difference. Uh, and now I can just wait with my king. Yeah. And after h5, play h3. I have to take stakes and should be winning. King d3. King e4. D five King E five D six D seven D eight here maybe not the sharp best move but okay this here 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 this this and meet and the name Quetaval GG's so I shouldn't say here all right, Telemus is on fire. GG, save points. Nice. Matt Nets 2023 from Austria. Welcome. Telemus, wow. Yeah, that's a great job from Telemus winning first three games. GG's. Yeah. Hi, Jundi, how are you? And the next opponent is going to be only twenty eight thousand players of Alicia Swans throws me. Yikes. Yikes, yeah. <laughs> Playing as penguinium. So like penguin but penguinium. Alright, interesting nickname. Let's go. Let's go G six and C five. So if you place E four Knight of Three it will be H A D. Okay, he plays bishop of four. Mm -hmm. Let's go queen a5. Uh, this. Here. d6. Here. I think I'll trade the not bishop for the knight. A5. Alright. Uh, castle. Okay, C8. Alright, it's me quite a while. Ah, nice! Yeah, good game, Zalmai. It was a good game. I think instead of rook h5, you had to go rook g5. I think it would be quite fine. I'm pretty sure. Uh, yeah, I would personally play this after ctx This There is rook g2 and perpetual. Good game, yeah. I think you unfortunately blundered a pawn. You had like rook c8 and you would be just fine there. But yeah. After after e5, I was already kind of winning. Not really winning, but better. Okay. All right. Oh, let's go knight d7. Move my knight. Mm -hmm. I think 
d5 because he has two bishops has kind of tried to restrict them see i missed something good too bad yeah but welcome to the steam peculiar city for my attack yeah yeah after c takes d if you want to continue attack i think you'd go like queen g4 or something trying to steal attack yeah yeah after the game in the hunter one sec well this guy's pre-moving quick Green Penguinio take, I think, just take the bishop and the knight and just dirty flag. Yeah, okay. Wait, yes, uh huh. Uh, Bell Bell Q2, welcome to the team. Welcome, welcome. Schlafen Schlafen played four games already. Yes, I showed five because he's playing fifth one and I cannot show four properly. So, but you get the point. <laughs> Telmus is on a great streak though, wow! He's playing in Bardic. Interesting, good luck Telmus. Head of choice in works, isn't it? Rasbush page 7 is amateur. Let's see who will be my next opponent. Alright, so how is everybody doing? Oh, Karma lost three games, unfortunately. It was good, but time is an issue. At least in one, or actually in two, he was like totally winning here, I think. No, wait, maybe not so totally win, but yeah, he's definitely with chances. It's probably a draw, but definitely with chances. And yeah, unfortunately, he lost though. Uh, okay, when are your next tournaments? What do you mean? Telemus is actually doing quite well against Bardic. Lins Matva Matva. Okay. I show speed live from USA. Welcome to the team. Over the board. I don't know, to be honest. And Jamo from Earth. Welcome. To be honest, zero idea. <laughs> Flagged K, yeah. Ah, man, this first I saw. I saw poor Karmar. Poor Karmar. Matva Matva is from Ukraine, right? Yeah. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I don't know how to play this actually. Woo! How do I play this? How do I play this? I don't know. Thank you for the follow. When it is slow at the same time, I can play and watch your stream, so I decide to watch your stream. Alright, but yeah, good game. One, one, Cleese on one, and Journey Chess. Thanks for the follow, guys. Road to 9k, I guess. Well, first 8.5k, uh, but then 9k. Slowly but surely. Increasing. I played this guy in. I didn't play this guy. No, I played this guy in bullet, and he was twenty two hundred. Oh, he has improved so much. That's impressive. Castle. Yes, yeah, so it's from Ukraine. All right, let's see. Bishop G four. But yeah, if you if you want to play Zalmai, then yeah, feel free to close the stream and play. But if you want to watch, then yeah, you're very welcome here as well. So <laughs> you're welcome everywhere. A six. D six E six, I think. Queen D seven. Well, let's play like rook d8, like perhaps something like this is an idea. Uh, 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 uh. Just tell him who's doing. Tell him who's. I think lost. I'm not sure though. It's very hard to tell. Is this point is annoying? I think I may do something like this as well. So like e5 idea, and at the same time like rook f8 idea. Here I thought knight h5 f6. Yes, bishop h6. Okay, if here I thought g5 and then take. Yeah. I thought queen c6, so the pawn is protected, this thing it looks okay. Uh, rook d6. Take me in the team. Yeah, wait a second, Ginger Slav, wait. I'll finish the game. I, I don't accept during the games. I finish the game and then I accept in the team. 
So yeah, wait, wait, like a minute. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll accept you. I'll accept you. Uh, I'm just plain. Yeah, I don't accept usually in whites while plain. Because I have to reload the page. Stellium was doing it the 2800. That's impressive. GG, Stellium moves. Oh. Uh. Well, that's scary. I'm gonna lie. Yeah, that's a terrible move. Impractical and positional. Okay, and draw three Matwa Matwa. Yeah, I don't know, I'm, way, I'm playing way too slow. Wait, two people to the team, right? Dressless Chess from India and Atomic Boredom Kikel from... I'm not sure, welcome. Yeah, I mean, I was winning GG. But yeah, I definitely could have won that. I know, I'm moving my mouse too slow. Took me like 0.3 each move. Yeah, that wasn't great, but yeah, my open played very well. And Telling Moose is continue to win. Wow, that's impressive. Bardic is on pause. Maybe I'll get him. I'm not sure. And I'm telling Moose is on pause. Hi, Kanimanara. How are you doing? Okay. Lynn's telling Moose. All right, he on pause. Nice. And let's go. Here, it's actually a pawn. Okay, it's all for the science, aka the content reason. Take, take, bishop g4 and rook c7, so then I'll finally get the pawn I sacrificed for practically no reason, rook c2, f5 I'll take, okay, takes anyway, he can castle, you gotta remember that, thanks, oh my, uh, let's see, bishop d, 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 Wait a sec, this is Playing laptop, no mouse. Okay, alright. Alright, Ginger is love. Don't worry. Try to play your best. This all doesn't matter here. Yeah, I'm playing with C2D6, that was F5. <laughs> okay. Here. How on earth I'm winning this? Zero idea. I'll try, I'll try. Yeah. Err. Looks dead drawn. Oops, here. Here. Uh -huh. Check. D6, I think it's safe to pre move. Oh, king 7 d6, that's actually a lot of value. And now nasty tactic, bishop b5, rook b7, I'm winning. Because 6, it's checkmate. Oh, no, my pawn, I say. But he cannot take it. He doesn't, but then I promote. That is really cool. Yes, f5, though. And now, I'll actually play e7. Rook b7 works as well. 
even 8xb rook c8 worked, but I like this the most. With rook b8. Hi, notification. How are you? And that should be a win. Yeah, and I want the team telling moves. Good games. Good game. Can watch episode of Benko from Lee Chess. Welcome to the team. Promotes on 704. <laughs> yeah. Don't worry, Karma. Grace has come back in my life. Nice. Nice, man, is first. Who did you come back against? Against Pookie. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. But the oh, wow. That is a comeback. I feel for Pookie, though. Oh, wow, wow. He blundered a queen. Oh, man, I feel so sad for Pookie. Oh, my goodness. And then he... Oh, and then in time trouble, he missed the pre move but yeah nice 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 resistance from manus purse wow but it's bardic zero one okay let's go bishop c5 mm -hmm. so this guy is from i don't know but he's 13 years old that's cool Here, six, here. I'm gonna go bishop a7 so d4 doesn't work. Okay. A d4 takes. I'll take. I'm not sure about taking twice. I'm sure about D takes C, but okay. On eighty five. Take take take. <laughs> Need to be crushed. <laughs> I'll try, I'll try. I mean one of us will probably get crushed or it will be a draw and none of uh, oh, and none of us will get crushed. How you do it totally journal? Do you speak German? Well I mean like really basic things, but well I mean technically yeah I do but like no I don't because it's awful. How are you doing totally juvenile? The kindergartens. <laughs> yeah, same. Did I just win a pawn? Not sure. Yeah. Feels so at least. Queen C2 loses after takes. That's where he goes Queen E's. Queen F3. Oh, 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 oh. I need to hurry. And I blundered. <sighs> yeah, I missed that. So for so much, and I missed it. Yikes. Uh huh. Are we taking a take? Sure. Maybe I'm alive here. I hope I am. Say draw, I guess. Yeah, but should for just repetition. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know, and I blundered draw fully. Oh wait, he doesn't go for a draw. Okay. Oh my goodness, and I blundered a rook. Why am I so blind and so slow today? What am I doing? I was just fine. Okay, that was awful. Then Bardic 01. How did I just blunder my rook and how was I so slow? Like, legit, the most easiest moves. Yeah, that was really bad. Just like go B8, I can never ever lose this. Wow. Okay. 
Probably Maxim from Romania. Welcome. Yeah, that was bad. Oof. I can teach pasta. All right. Okay. Yeah, that was bad. <laughs> Legit, so so bad. That was not a bad game, but uh, the fact how I played Drukhasi while thinking for four seconds, that was very bad. The German there is Zuxon and Tvashin Zuk. The German, yeah, exactly, Bunkenator, yeah. Who's dominating the tournament, yeah. Yeah, but I'm playing awfully today. Just a great position, first I blunder this. Second, I just blunder a rook out of like unlosable position. Just play rook b8, rook f8, and I'm fine. Then it's moose, alright. It's an important game, I guess. Then it's rook to gm, just trash. So I don't know, welcome. Huh, <sighs> okay. And I want to go for content. I guess my performance is slowly going to 1200 by losing. <laughs> cool, I guess, but yeah. I'm not happy with my performance so far. Lost the first game awfully, then won a little, then drew totally win because I'm just moving my hand so slowly, then lost the previous game where I was not lost for sure because I'm slow and I blunder. That's oh, wow, Moose just blundered. Oh, okay. I know that I'm telling was ages, blonde at night age six. Queen d7. That is lucky. Takes. Takes and an h4, g4, like this. I should win. I know that I'm telling was nice. Is it nice? Alright. At least a quick win, which I was uh, lost from the opening. Playing pretty well for having stomach flu. Yeah, tell me, you're playing extremely well. And yeah, sorry to hear that it didn't become better, but yeah. I wish that I. I yeah, I wish that. Uh, yeah, your stomach flu disappears. Let's see who will be my next opponent. We have 34 people. Let's load and Vampire Rage! Dark chess without the dark. Sanchez Berzane from Earth, welcome. So playing uh, Vampire Age, Dark chess without the dark. That is quite interesting. Um, so knight bd2. Here, we get the Slav. Takes, takes. Uh, here. This. Dark chess without the dark, yeah. That is every time when we'll play when I'll play Vampire Age in normal chess I'll say Oh I'll play Vampire Age in Dark Chess only without the dark. Okay, he cannot take I think Okay Bishop H4 So if Bishop C5 there is Bishop F6 and Queen G4 This this yes Oh he blunder an exchange that's huge He had to take knight e seven I'm just winning Maybe I actually had to go Queen D3 first. I'll, 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 I'll just take. I don't need any problems. I don't need any 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 adventures, you know. Just need some totally winning position without like any risks. Here C6 idea. Nice move from him. Let's play Queen G3 then. Yeah, that's a nice move. I'm, I'm on so many chances to my opens today. It's quite bad. Hold on, is the queen trapped? Uh, maybe. I know he has queen c4. I'm, I'm playing some very scary, dangerous chess for myself. Uh, queen d2. Ay, ay, ay. It's an interesting looking move. Uh, but I think okay, see one does just this just swings now. We need to this before this. <clears throat> I'm not sure. Looks like it does. Maybe it doesn't. Maybe zero if you want to take before. I think it does. 
It'll be one and I take the night. Nice. <clears throat> and with the name Vampire Rage. GG's. How to tell if winning with the dark. Exactly, exactly. Yeah. And yeah. Soon it'll time run out. I'll just take this and take that. Less pieces. The, the less pieces there are, the better. Rook. Get my give my own rook, but yeah. Another vampire rage, nice. Oh, pseudo Benko. Maybe I can get paired against him. Yes, I do. Then scan us pseudo Benko. Cool, good luck. He was like 2400 as well. Wow, the people grow so much in rating. That is very cool. One year ago, he was. He was 2400 and now he is ACM and uh, 2700. Great job, guys. Hi Rezan, how are you doing? And Bardic, I think he's on pause. Oh, uh, Bishop G4. Probably D5 or something like this, yeah, is gonna happen. It's about to say Bishop F6. Went from 1000 to 1. Do nice! Nice, totally journal. Hi to Blechik, how are you doing, everybody, today? Let's play on K8. Yeah, 95, that's unfortunate, pleasant. <sighs> okay, that's nice. Oh, the position is so annoying. Just don't know what to play. Like, Cozy is fun, but it's not fun sometimes. Ah, uh, b5, I think, has to be played. Here, so I have like c6. Here. Ah, uh, now I take. I think I'm like stabilizing my position. Uh -huh. Here. B for idea. B four. Am I winning a piece? Am I winning a piece? I think e7 is square. No, wait, d8. Perhaps is the best square. So c7 is protected as well. So this yet like rook c1, eight, c7. Now my bishop protects. I'm not sure though. I think it's good. Because e7, I couldn't take c4, e4 as well. h5, I think, knight f8. Yeah, I think that has to be played. I mean, 97 was possible. I mean, I think both, even 98 shade was fine. But I don't know, knight f8, keeping the knight somewhat active. Mm, and at the same time, it also got h7, which can be important. That's a free pawn, I think. Uh, bishop g5. No, I think I'll play queen f6. Mm, c5, e5 doesn't work because this knight on f8. That's a very, very important job of guarding h7, rook a d8. Gotta keep this knight like forever now, I think. Ah! Ah, I need to make a move. Queen e6. He cannot take, so I think d5 is a nice move. Maybe it's not though. I'm not sure. This, this. Rook d2, and that's made now. Yes, another name can ask Pseudo Benko. Finally a good game! Like that that took way too long. It took like ten games. Rostem Ezal, welcome to the team. Took way too long! Oh my goodness, that took way too long. Have a good tournament, I'll see you. Alright, take care. Yeah, GG Pseudo Chess. Take care, Journey Team. Then it's Bell Bell Q2. And he Zergs! Oh my! He Zergs! Link of the tournament. It's in the pink common, right? Yeah, I think so. It's in the pink common vibe. Hey, why didn't you pre-move, sir? Bell, 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 bell. Why didn't you pre-move? I had you to pre-move. Is it ginger? Perhaps it's ginger is love. But man, you had to pre-move. We ain't going on scripts anymore. But okay, queen b5. I think I get the pawn back, so it's fine. It's fine. And I have queen b4. Very, very, very resourceful. Uh, uh. On h4. I, I miss this h4 stuff. Okay. 
Uh, wait, I'm bishop f4. Here, ah, you're just this, all right. Oh, queen b5. And takes it in this. <laughs> the stuff when I read it, I was like, what? <laughs> but then, okay, and this is that it's a nickname. Oh gosh, Ginger, you got me. I was like, hey, yo, what's going on? <laughs> Redrim Bell Bell Bell, Bell Q2. <laughs> Almost got a 6 2600. Good job, man, you spurs. Unfortunate, but good job. Thank you for the follow. Radovid to Dobrezion. Enjoy stay here in the fun. Oh, Ginger, you, 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 you scared me for a second. Bell Bell, okay, cool. But yeah, you played a nice game. GG's. Yeah, good game, good game. Oh, Junji played a lot of. No, it's Pookie who played a lot of games. Okay, please can also sell the banker once again. Can you help me with the title verification? If you know any delicious guy, try to fill that form but can't upload the photo you chose error. I don't know anybody from Liches to be absolutely fair. I mean I heard of them, but like I'm not close friends with anyone. Maybe you can write it on forums? I'm not sure. Maybe forums, which is usually the place you go last. You go to last, but like Maybe they can help, I'm not sure. Looking for under 15 on it. <laughs> Good luck, Fuki. Forms will help? I'm not sure, maybe. I'm not sure, because when I verified my title, it was easier. I, I mean, it was easy. Thanks, yeah, you're welcome. But I'm not sure if it will help. I'm not guaranteeing you. I'm just saying maybe it will. Maybe. But I'm not sure. Uh, so basically, yeah. Good luck, Fuki. Uh, Bishop F6. Hey, oh, yeah, 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 c3. I mean, rook f8, I think I'm still... No, wait, then I'm losing. I pause for a moment, waiting for a delivery. Okay, 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 karma, take care, take care. Wait a second, am I throwing? Am I throwing? Queen a4, I think it's fine, though. Still, I mean, I lose a pawn, but I don't lose it to have queen a2. But yeah, I'm not sure how else, because for me, there was... If still lose, I tell me, I think it's just losing a lot. It's unfortunate. Because, like, when, for me, there was no error while sending a photo. So, like, I'm not sure. Maybe, maybe forums will help. Maybe somebody else had this problem. Maybe the admins will see it. But, yeah, I'm not sure. I'm not guaranteeing you that it will help. Mm. I hope it will, though. I sure hope it will. C5? Whew. Yes, 96. <clears throat> Can I take clock good for me? Okay. Uh huh. Here. I think I want a pawn. Uh, take. I uh, cannot take FC1. Perhaps I have to see the best, but then like 95, 90. Take. Ah, uh huh. Rook e8, rook e5, take, rook c, ah, rook c8 is there. What if queen a2? Should I take the pawn? Gotta make a move, gotta make a move, gotta make a move soon. Rook eight, rook c8. Very, very unfortunate, I think. I think queen a2 is fine. I'm sure. Yeah, now it takes, but now I want a pawn. I'm a little bit behind the time, but I have a pawn, like some knight of three, so now he has to spend time figuring out. Good that he is, doesn't have any sin on light squares now. Yeah, that's a nice move, love it. Uh huh. Should be one or this. I think I'll do that, trade in the knight for bishop. Yeah, he does. He was like almost forced, I'm pretty sure. Ah, uh, do I win this? Queen b7. Queen f7. Queen d5, and then a5. Huh? A4 Queen B3 That's time. Time is very low. Queen C2 Queen E4 Let's go F4. That's a risky, risky move. I'm not sure why I'm doing it. Check, check. Check, check. Oh no! Oh, I almost refolded. 
Oh my goodness, that was too close. I almost three folded. Now listen, sell me team another three on Sedo Benko. I almost three folded, that was so that was too close. Woo! Yeah, rain it rains all up from Kenya, welcome. Yeah yeah. I'm sorry. I was a game. Ooh, that was way too close. I almost three folded by by an accident. GG pseudo. That was good. That was fun. When is first this almost got Oh Oh yeah, that was actually scary. Oh yeah, man, it's that was close, wow. So we have another 2600 rated player here. The star 97 from Romania, cool. It's a strong tournament. Oh, two more people. Anirud, 45 from Earth, and Vince of Eagle from, I don't, 2967, oh gosh. If you'll join the tournament, there will be very stacked tournament. I'm playing against MJMO, so you gotta get the queens as quick as possible, because, yeah, I just gotta, like, try. To win as fast as again, because so start tournament, many people zerg. When yeah, kinda need to get wins faster than them if I want to win it. Should be five. Uh this is three. They almost finally won him, and the star is very close actually. Like yeah, I haven't seen him, and I was like in top three already, and very very close to top one. So today is a very crazy stacked tournament. I think like one of, and 60 viewers, well, yeah, now 60. Thank you guys, everybody for watching. Hope you're having fun. So you're okay, you want? Funny delivery guy, a very tall and big guy who has a voice like a kid. Okay, cool. Cool. But nice that he delivered. Very nice. I want to give GG Spooky. Congrats. I'm done. All right, okay. But yeah, thanks for playing. Congrats for winning, though. Hi, Dox is Vaishenzuk. How are you doing? We were talking about Vaishenzuk today. I'm doing great. What about you? We were just talking about Vaishenzuk like 10 minutes ago. We were talking about German and we were like, um, yeah, most people were like, oh, well, uh, for me, everything is enough. Like, yeah, just no Vaishenzuk and Zooks. Why can I think I know German good? Yeah, I also am like that. Whoa, so did you have with Prime. Thank you so much. I'm doing good too, that's nice. Thanks, Pseudo Chess. This, hold on, he has to go King H6. <gasps> if King H6, I was Rook D5, Rook H5, Queen G5. Wow, can he go King H5, please? I wanna showcase. No! That was Rook D5, he was the Queen, Rook H5, Queen G5. Ay ay ay. I'm not German. Yeah, yeah, but we were talking about Swiss and Zook. <laughs> half of the chat is German, right? I think, maybe, I'm not sure if half, but definitely we have like at least, I think, 20% of chat, I'm not sure. Oh, wait, two people. I accepted them. Uh, funny thing, I can say Schwarz and Zook correctly. I'm not sure if my anyone remember Jamu. I'm not sure if my pronunciation is correct as well, but Schwarz and Zook. I think it's correct, though. I hope it's correct. This is 2980 guy joined the tournament or no? Not yet. Maybe he already won a game. Oh, yeah, he did. Mamma mia, that is a stacked, stacked tournament. 114 puzzle races, this guy is good, wow. And Jay Hall is up to tier 1 for 2 months, thank you so much, always a pleasure to watch you play, thank you, thank you. Thanks for the sub for 2 months already. Then it's Matwa Matwa, let's go D5, C5, uh, take, take and D5. 114 puzzle racer, yeah that's insane, this guy is gonna be very, very hard open I think. 2916 bullet? And then 114 puzzle racer, that is so cracked, wow. Alright. Uh, yeah, but there are a lot of also people who are 2600, which are also very, very good at chess. So yeah, that's a really, really interesting tournament today. So everybody, if you want to join, there is a link in pink comment. Hype train is closing it. If it will miss our station, it will be shame that he wasted five minutes of people trying to join the tournament. Uh, and you can also find the link in my team on leeches. I think this Lancet Castle is a good move, so now I can take E takes D. Uh oh, there is H6 and then Bishop G5. He does Bishop G5 immediately, but now I think there is H6 and I think I should be alive. Yeah, I think I'm right now. I'm just two pawns up, as it seems. With no huge compensation, I think. Hopefully. Let's go to IG4 with Knight of 2 idea. Uh, 
Oh, if bishop g4, bishop g4. Should be three pawns up, maybe even. Oh, yeah, he goes queen d5, but. Ah, bishop b6, bishop b6. Wait, but this is this, bishop g4, bishop g4, I'm not sure. I am not sure at all. The yeah, stakes, I couldn't take the queen because pinned. Queen of 7, bishop d1. I cannot draw arrows, but that doesn't matter. Ah, should I just take h5? Maybe. I think I will, actually. This queen of 5, king b8. If this, there is like, or rook h8 or bishop d6. If I play like bishop d6, I'm just two whole healthy pawns up. So it goes rook h4. I um, think rook h8 is good. I'm not sure. I'm like trying to get into an open file. Take bishop g6. If queen e5, I'll just play queen c6. Just say, please, please just trade the queens off the board. I want to have fun position. Um, I want to ch have chill position, I mean. Ah, ah, interesting. Take, take this rook d6 is there. King send there is rook c5. Oh, man, that's scary. I think king c7, the word. Bishop d6, I take. Queen c6, king c6. I'm not sure. Looks fine, though. Uh, I'll go queen e4 if this king c6. Kind of fearless, but I think it works because queen b1. How is he stopping that? I'm not sure. And that just looks winning. If he takes for it, I'm winning for sure. If he doesn't, I think I'm winning anyways. Hi, thanks, Darko. Thank you so much. How are you doing? So, yes, king c6. And if you move the queen, queen b1 and rook d6. Uh, and I'll just take the free queen, I guess, then. <laughs> I thought queen b1, there is force made, but I didn't see it. And Matva, and I'm wondering, Matva, Matva. Good game. Let's see. 38 minutes left of the tournament. Almost again. Oh, wow, Manius first is going good. Wow. Maybe not on points, but yeah, he's playing very, very interesting chess. Finally, the hype train is gone. Uh, hello, my dude, zero nine from Turkey. Welcome. We are like nearing eighteen hundred or oh, eighteen twelve hundred on each team as well, aren't we? It's insane. So maybe good things passing. Yeah, you're welcome. I think we're actually nearing it. Sizafu from Ukraine. Yeah, nineteen eleven seventy five. Wow. Perhaps twelve hundred today as well. Cool. Then the star ninety seven. That's another. Guy was really irating. I haven't played today, so let's go. He's from Romania, and he goes for peers. Perhaps we'll transform into King's Indian. We do. Knight B D seven. This H three. Perhaps the Bishop B three works. Knight D five. Yeah, I think that's another main line. Ah, uh, but I'll do something like that. I think I'm slightly worse here, but it should be fine. Let's go Bishop A three. So everybody, if you want to join the tournament, there is a link in pinned comments. Go here. I haven't played this guy, even though I definitely remember him, and I was like ninety nine percent sure I've played him. But th apparently that's the first time, which is cool. Let's take yes ninety three. But he oh I blundered a skewer. Uh oh, I blundered a skewer. Yikes! Oh and he missed the skewer. Well, that is kind of lucky, not gonna lie. I think I'm gonna play like rook c2 now. So bishop h6, I can just come back to e2 or e1, and it should be okay. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see, what do I play? f4, I think it's a good move. Though here again is bishop h6, which can be un unpleasant. But yeah, I think f4, it's okay, an okay move. Okay. So bishop is 6, I think, or rook f2 or queen f1. Even though the knight doesn't hang still. That is a little downside. Perhaps rook f2, so my queen is still lying the h5 pawn. Goes knight d7, though. Uh, what if I, like, double up on e-file? I'm not sure. It looks fun, but it doesn't look that great. I think I'll just come back to... Or I'll play king h1, just to get my king away from potential... Queen b6, skewers, kind of stuff, you know. Okay. This. Oi, oi, oi. Some dogs screaming outside. Ah, uh, yeah, knight h5 is an interesting idea. My, my, my pieces are very, very uncoordinated. After knight h5 takes, 
May as well, I may have to sack an oh, I don't have to sack an exchange. Knight h5, knight h4, bishop c3, this, yep. Oh, he takes this. I thought if bishop c3, there is rook e3, knight e4, queen e1, but this I have to go rook f2. Oh, and then I blundered an exchange. No, I didn't. Oh my goodness, guys, there's so many exchange blunders, but I don't think I actually blunder. Maybe I am, but he doesn't play it, so like, insane, insane chess this game. Uh, let's go bishop b2, and time trouble is nearing us, so that's gonna be insane and intense. Uh, if, yeah, oh, I blundered an exchange again. Or a pawn, I'm not sure, I'm blundering so much, I think, but... They end up not like not as not as blunders. Bishop d4 was planning in d5, so like I again blunder as he were with an exchange, but I have knight d5. So like what a crazy game this is. Oh, knight d5, really nice idea. Ah uh, ah uh, ah uh, ah uh, ah. Uh. Kind of gotta hurry. I think I'll move my knight. Oh, did I blunder my knight? Oh no, I mean this. I'm fine. I think. I'm trouble is really close. Ah, I, got an, I should not panic. And play it safe. Let's better get my knight out because this knight is protected. Uh, yeah. Queen cannot be stuck. I have queen h4 at the very least. I'll take take knight g5. Uh, I need to take up seven here. I think I'll play queen e6. And then knight g5, knight f3. And yeah, he has four seconds and I have 16. I think I should have plenty. Yeah, now I even want two pawns. And uh, the third, third one, fourth one, it was a little dirty, and I promoted Queen of the Names to star 97. Well, that was an insane game. My goal is top three. But it will be tough with Benko in 97. Yeah, but yeah, it wins a vehicle. I think you definitely can do it. Good luck to your goal. Good luck. Almost again, yeah. One city, yeah. Cool, Shizafu. Sizafu. Yeah, that was like an insane game, uh, but it was very, very fun to play. Like, it was very scary when I feel like I blunder an exchange or something, but I don't. Then I feel like I blunder again, but I don't again. And like, the, like that, that was very insane. Um, so yeah, right now we have 42 players, which is huge. Uh-oh, and I think I will get paired against Soda Benko. We will see. We have the same amount of points, so right now... We have 40, we are sharing top 1. Let's see if I'll get him or I'll get someone else. Maybe he's playing already. No, he isn't. So I may get paired against him. Oh, that's interesting. Yes, I'm playing against... I'm listening. I'm tense. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Yeah, dressless. Okay. Then can was the pseudo bank hall. Um, yeah, good luck, I guess. I'm for the third time against him out of three. Playing with the black pieces, but I'm fine. With that, it's cool, it's fun. Um, there's, at some point, it will be fun if we'll get to play again. It'll be fun to try him as white to see how he plays as black. Bishop g4 works, I guess. I mean, it will be an opposite color bishop end game, but he doesn't go for it. Alright, then I'll play queen d6. This is play rook f8 with queen e6 idea. E yep. Okay. Bell Bell is actually inserted. Wow, that is an interesting, yeah. An un unpredictable result. It's still like one third of the tournament going, so it's still everything can change and probably will change. Uh, but definitely very, very exciting. Hi, Rezan. Let's do this. B5, B5, B5 looks fine, actually. Queen before there is a5, then I'm winning. He has this or that though. So maybe b5 was any good move because I weakened up my pawn structure. I'm not sure. Knight d6. Oh, that feels like a good move. Oh, yeah, that is a really, really good move. He did. Ay, ay, ay. I think I'll have to go to. I'll have to take and I'll like c5, c4. Oh, wait, here I have this, don't I? I think I do. Still is very, very unpleasant. Yeah, I think I just have to accept the fact that I'm a pawn down and then try to activate my rook, rook d2, rook here. Oof, position is rough. But rook a2, I think I should I be able to survive this. Let's go rook b2. And yeah, it will be 3 on 4, it is a draw. Uh, but I'm not sure. I definitely, 
unless some miracle cannot win this. Uh, but I'll try. Yeah, and he doesn't want to draw, he'll probably try to flag me because I'll have less time than him. And uh, yeah, it's gonna make a lot of moves. Yeah, this is gonna be really unpleasant to play. It's too many time left, too much time left. Uh, 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 uh. And I don't have much time. Okay. Okay. Ah, am I throwing with this? I'm not sure. Probably shouldn't have allowed g5. Here. Here. Yeah, I have no time left. It's very, very unfortunate. Here. And I do have 20 seconds, but it's not much compared to his, like, 45. The checks, 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 checks. Here. Check, check. I'm on the lawn side with my rook. Check, check, check. Gosh, g5. Uh-huh. Yeah, and I just do not have enough time. Played extremely quickly. I tried my best, but I got brutally flagged. Or, I mean, okay, I was lost now. Uh, I was draw! <laughs> it was really good, I so Benko. It played so quickly, that was insane. Aye, aye, aye. Yeah, it was a good game. I, I held it extremely well. I think I held it by literally the best 14,000 14, performance. GG. Yeah, GG, so to chess. You played so well. And congrats to Karmar. I defended so well, I had no time. I thought for too, too much. You know, I think I, I played. Uh, I mean, yeah, maybe I was lost here. Perhaps, yeah, G5 was a bad move. King F7. But I had no time left. I played in Stalin moves, alright. Uh, yeah, let's go C5. Okay, okay, takes here. Moose is pre-moving. Whoa! Gotta be careful. D6. This here, 97. Who are giving a voice over? What do you mean, wizard? It's I'm playing and talking. <laughs> what do you mean? A5. B5. A4. A6. Idea like 94. I'll play queen b6, I'll try to push. Oh, he blundered an exchange, that's, that's huge. And he blundered a bishop. So, and now knight, knight g4. Well, not knight, but like knight g4. And it should be winning. Uh, yeah, I found a nice tactic. Here, here, and I win a queen. This, queen e3, rook. Okay, knight f4, this, and that's mate. You know that I'm telling moose. Okay, gg, moose. Ugh. I finally won. Whew. Well, not finally, but I won. <laughs> H6? Who? Is Pseudovenko throwing the game? F6 is there. Can I fade? Huh, I'm not sure. Feels like Zrost MS something, but I'm not sure. Twins. Oh, Wings lost to somebody. Wings lost to Matwa. Ah, interesting. Okay. I challenge with Benko. Yeah, I tried, but like, it look, it was so drawn. It was drawn for literally the rest of the whole game. There it was a bundle at like 13 seconds left. I like had no time left, unfortunately. And here was a draw again. I started throwing with the rook trade. I know. Oh, I'm playing against Dressless Chess. That's Ginger Slav. Hi, Cell Service. You and Adam, right? I think I played you in Rapid some time ago. If I'm not confusing you with anyone. How, how are you doing? Hi, how are you doing? Uh, let's castle this bishop d7. Uh, let's play knight d3. Banco won. Good job, Banco. Yes, it was a while back. Yeah, yeah I remember. No, all right, that's nice to hear. I think I'll play bishop d5. It's like e5 ideas. 
takes and then e5. I think I win a pawn. He has bishop e7. He cannot take because I take and then rook d7. He cannot take because queen d7. So he has to go bishop e7 or this, but then I win a pawn, which is quite nice. I mean, every single piece helps, even a pawn helps. Wow, bell, bell, q q2. Wow, oh, he's about to knock me off to sub to, to, to 2. Yeah, 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 yeah. I gotta be careful. Yes, let's go queen b7. I blundered a pawn though, fortunately. Queen of 2 is in a threat. Yeah, wow, bell, bell, knocked me off top 2. Whoa, what a turnaround. Told you guys everything will change. It's insane. That is insane. All right. Uh, 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 let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Yeah, so rook d5 is a threat from my opponent, which I don't want to blunder, so I think I'm going to play... I'm not sure, actually. Why did I... I had, like, a voice crack there. Uh, that happens. Um, uh, 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 I mean, okay, knight e3. Yeah, I don't want to do that, but I think I have to play knight e3 and f takes c. Berserk can help. Yeah, he does, but I don't know. I'm no berserk gang. I'm, I'm no berserk... Berser I'm just not moving quick enough. Yeah, Pseudo just f brutally flagged me. Uh, it was a dr drone position, 4-3, rook endgame, but I just couldn't handle the the time pressure. I'm way too slow. Uh, let's play knight of 5 I think it's a good move. Do, 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 do. He has ideas to take, so I think I'm gonna play rook. Oh no, maybe I'll actually just will let him take, play g3, let him take, play knight d6, and knight f7. So, okay, he doesn't take. Then, for sure, I'll play rook ac1. Rook ab1 was interesting. Let's lose those positions. The Felidor one? So, which positions? Or, or you mean 3 v 4 Darko. So, yeah, rook e1. If take, take, okay, that's unfortunate. He has rook e2, which I missed. Time, yeah, yeah. I missed that. I miscalculate. I think I'm gonna play a4. Let him take. Um, this ending. Ah, uh, yeah, okay. Yeah, this ending 3v4 is really... It, it was, like, really annoying to hold it. I held it. I just had not enough time at the end. I'll give him a check. Then, I think knight g4. Position is completely drawn, but I am going to try to win this on time. Oh, wait a second. I think he blundered very big time. Yeah, he did. And now I take. After he takes, I have g4 and the rook is pinned. That is huge, 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 huge blunder. And I win a rook, then king g3, and he pinned himself once again. And so you go king g5, but then h4. And then queen e4, I just wait for him to play h5, and then I'm winning. Great job, uh, Ginger Slav, for dressless chess on Lee Chess. But yeah, unfortunately, you blundered. But yeah, you played extremely, extremely well. Two people want to join the team. Let's see, Young Fisher 12 from England and Maha Prince 09 from Canada. Welcome. Ah, oh, now I flag a game. Okay, Karma finished for today. Good job, Karma. Good job. Oh, you won again. That's nice. You won against Vanya Spurs. That was a good game, actually. Yeah, you played extremely well. Played really, really good chess, uh, Ginger. Uh, but yeah, unfortunately, in time trouble, you blundered. All right. Let's see who will be my next opponent. Gosh, this game was awful. Let's see. Oh, the star post after I beat him. Okay. Matva Matva won against Rostem. Yeah, just... Yeah, peace blunder somehow. Oi! Yeah, be careful, guys. I'm playing Smatva Matva, so time playing him with black. <laughs> so today against strong open, so I'm very lucky to get black all the time. So against Matva Matva, thrice I got black. Against Pseudo Benko, I got black three times. Cool. I think I take, right? Yeah, I've played this guy. Remember, we had this. This is. Wait, what? Does it work as well? Wow, I've never seen that before. That is interesting. I saw there is bishop d5 but knight c3. That is nasty as it seems. Or did you just blunder? I'm not sure. I'm gonna take bishop f5. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Yes, yeah, so everybody, if you want to join the tournament, there is link in pinned comment. Uh, but wait, bishop f5? Oh, knight d5. Uh oh. Wait a second. Oh my goodness. I make it mated here. Uh oh, that is really scary. So I'm not great at applying pressure. Okay. 
All right, I think I'm gonna play bishop c5. If he's threatening mate, then why can't I, guys? Why shouldn't I, and why can't I? Oh, but that definitely looks very scary. Very, very scary. Mm, I'm gonna take... Okay, if rookie 4 king of 8, I should survive this, I'm pretty sure, hopefully. Uh, but yeah, that is scary. I should have probably just taken d takes c and just relax there. Oh, because now this is a mind-blowing chess. Yes, that is a move. I cannot take this bishop because my bishop is pinned, but I'll take with the pawn and take And if he takes queen d8, he doesn't. Ay, ay, ay. My king is in castle, so it is quite scary. Uh-oh. What do I even do? Let's see. I think I'm gonna play queen d7, rook e8, just trade the rooks off. We were at 67 viewers, now we're at 64. Thank you. Thank. Welcome, everybody. Thanks for tuning in today. So yeah, queen d7, rook e8 idea. Okay. Yeah, definitely scary. We are just at move 13, but we're already both down under a minute. Uh, okay. I won a game with a queen side. Good job, Karma! Nice! He's playing well. Very well. Maybe bishop d6 isn't the best move to rook because of rook d1. And he finds it. That's nasty. I think I'm gonna play f6 then. Because I don't know what else. And uh oh, that is definitely scary. Maybe I'm just losing. Though I think there is this resource queen e7. Uh oh, and he didn't win a pawn. Oh, but he won an exchange. Oh, I blundered. Oh no. He didn't win a pawn, but he won something better than a pawn. Uh oh. Alright, I'll play h6. This is some exciting chess. Yeah, some crazy, crazy chess. We had moved 21, and we had done one and a half minutes, which is insane. And bishop d6, there is c5. Uh-oh, I don't like my position too much. I think I'll play queen e2, like just trying, kind of out of desperation. But maybe not really out of desperation. Bishop d6, really unfortunate c5. At queen e2, which I missed, so maybe I was fine there, but yeah. It's kind of hard to find. Uh, queen d6, let's play... I know what to play, I don't want to trade queens. I don't see a move, how to not trade queens. Queen h5, that's a terrible move though, I think. Bishop d6, I'm surviving. Alright, time trouble comes. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh, he blundered rook! Oh my goodness, he blundered rook! Okay, 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 okay. F5, let's go, let's go! It's a huge blunder. Queen e4, queen trade, let's go. King d4. Oh my goodness, he blundered rook. Oh my gosh, so lucky. Five king before. Just be careful. Take the pawn, and I'll slowly but surely push the passer. Check, check. H five. And I wonder what my watch was. Oh, I was lost, but he blundered a move in one rook. The, no, he blundered. That didn't. He didn't blunder a move in one rook. He blundered a rook in one move. Oh, what a relief! What a relief that was. Oh, I can finally breathe. I can finally breeze. Whoa! And a dirty flag from Soda Banco against Rossim Izal. Queen H5, one move away from draw. But Banco flagged. This open and that's insane. Wow. Let's see who I'll get next. That's my opponent. Join. Yeah, I think Soda pulling away. Yeah. Yeah, everybody is doing an amazing job. And thanks, Rossim Izal and his Zergs. Ooh, interesting. All right, let's play 96 takes bishop b4 you had queen e8 in which exact moment <gasps> oh oh so all oh, right all oh, right <laughs> i had queen e8 and I, wow good job yeah i missed that guys wow in previous game in previous game wait let me show you real quick right right about here good point when my opponent played queen d8, I played king f7, but I had queen e8, and I didn't have to sack my exchange. That's a nice point. I totally missed that. Good job. And bmaps notice after tier 1 for 50 months. Thank you so much. Welcome. How are you doing, bmaps naughty? Baker came up on top with the most hardest drift, yeah. Let's play bishop e6. 
I'm gonna go with some crazy, crazy attack. And thank you for the follow, Ruyami Galiba. Ruyami's Galiba. Enjoy your stay here and have fun. If he will take, I'm gonna take h3. He doesn't, though, which is kind of unfortunate. Play bishop d4, though. All right. Wins is catching me. Uh oh. I think I may lose top three. I'll go for sacrifice. I don't care. And I think I just won two pawns, didn't I? I'm not sure. I hope so. Let's play bishop f6. Oh, knight c5. Gotta be careful. My kid is very exposed. Uh oh. That is very scary position. I'm too good. Yeah. It's a great job, Soda. You're playing very well. I saw how you flagged Rostam Izal last game. That was very, very close, but great, great skills. Let's play Rook B F8. Uh, Rook H6. Ah, nice, nice responsibility. I'm gonna take though, and I blundered. Oh man, he had Queen C3, Queen G7. <laughs> yeah, and if I take, he has Queen G7. I got a little lucky. Let's play Rook F6, so he doesn't have Queen F5. Okay, and then, then yeah, and then Rosti, Rostem Izal, GG's, I'm top two, let's go! Maybe wins will push me out of top three, but maybe I'll stay in top two. Did you be a smarter? 3100, imagine 3100 joins the tournament, that will be insane, wow. Let's see. So wins is playing against Pseudo, I'm hoping for Pseudo because I want to, oh, you had to take B3 Pseudo, I think. 95 or 95, 95, 95, oh, like, wow, what a resource, what a, what a brilliant play from Wings of Ego, that was insane, great job, let's see, will I get Pseudo, will I get Wings, or will I get Bell, I get Bell, alright, I'm very happy with that, is, yeah, I'm very, very happy, um, me and Wings are actually tight, which is eh, a little bit not nice. G4 for content! He took. Interesting. E5. Uh, let's go bishop B5. And then, ah, that's a nice move. All right, this. E6. I sacked two pawns for content. I hope I'll get something. Knight G5. Knight E6. And then Knight C5. I got them back. And we got like an insane position here. I think I'll play queen e2. Uh, oh, 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 oh. If you take, okay, I'll take, I'll take with, oh my goodness, am I getting checkmated here? I think I gotta go bishop e3. The rook e8. Wait a second, guys, am I getting checkmated? I have to castle short, I think. Uh oh, that is very, very scary stuff. I think I'll go queen b5. I don't think it loses on the spot. But, oh! It is definitely scary. Yes, rook f3. Gosh, that's scary. Wait a second, queen d7. Wait, am I just mating? <gasps> Guys, I think I'm mating him. Ooh, that's huge. I was like probably lost. And he resigned with him. Bell, bell, q2. <gasps> what a game. Ooh. Ooh. That was, that was very, very lucky. Yes, it's queen b5. Rook f3 at knight bd2. Because rook f3, very cool move. I cannot take us mate. Otherwise, like... Yeah, but I had knight d2. Yeah, I was like minus, he had mate in 14. It was a terrible game for me. But I went for content and content paid off. Let's see, it'll be my next open. Probably pseudo. Uh, let's see, it will be... Not sure. It is Kenros and Pseudo Benko. Finally, I get white against him. Let's go. Uh, Killian, welcome from Puerto Rico. Welcome to his team. I gotta keep up the pace against Benko. It's very fast. I never went for Catalan. No, well, not never. I haven't went for Catalan in a long time. Uh, 92. Takes. Yeah, that line works. He sacks a pawn. Like, Rook C8 is fine there. Yeah, this and uh, knight b3, a5, or something like that. Wait a sec, I think I'll go knight b, knight g5? Yeah, I'll go knight g5, let's go. If takes, I'll take b7, I'll take a6. Maybe I'll play c6, actually, I'm not sure, I gotta think real quick there. Because otherwise, mate threat, he has to take this, rook c7, I think, bishop a6, knight b5, bishop b5, don't I just win two balls? I'm not sure, maybe I am. Talking too fast. Mm, yeah, I think I take b5 and I think I should just win two pawns. We'll see though. Rook b8, bishop c4. You, you don't usually want to pin your own piece to your queen, but I think here it is a, an exception. 
Um, and this is quite fine. Let's go rook a6. Mm, Vince is top 2. He was hoping for top 3, but now he can actually maybe get top 1. That's insane. Wow. Right, let's play queen d2. Let's go. Uh, queen d8. I'm not sure. I don't want to trade, but I don't know. I have to, I think. Uh, definitely wanted to keep the queens on the board. Oh, I bought a pawn. Uh oh. Uh oh. All right. It's still fine. I'm a pawn up. Maybe not two pawns, but it's still a pawn, right? I gotta keep the speed up, though. It just blocks everything. Eh. That is very, very rough. Let's go e5. Mm, man, that's rough. Can he blunder e6? No, he doesn't. Can he blunder e6? No, he doesn't. Can he blunder e6? No, he doesn't. Wait, he can actually blunder e5 if I'm not careful enough. Let's go f4. Whew, okay, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Perhaps, wait, should I transfer him to the end game? Should I transfer? No, he has bishop e3 there. Ah, that's unfortunate. I'll go here. Mm. Mm, take, take, before this is. I'm not sure. It's very commercial. Just going to a drone broken. Gosh, I'm not sure I'll go for it. Maybe that's a blunder which I lose, but I kind of am desperate. Well, Winds of Eagle can get top one, actually. If he keeps up the pace, that's insane. Uh, now let's go rook b6. I have zero idea how I'm going to break through and bank with more time. I'll go g4, though. I'll try, I'll try. Perhaps, like, king g5. Maybe I'm actually going to break through. Uh, rook b6. Um, okay, I think rook d6 is a good move. Though, I'm not sure how I'm going to win this. Let's see. Ah! Can I get a commit? I don't want to commit. Uh oh. Here! Hold on! And rook h6, rook g6. Ooh, that may be a huge, huge win. I'm not sure if I'll win it. Still have to. Uh, yeah, I'm totally winning, but I still have to win. Show the technique. Uh, king g6, king h7, this, this, this. Should be winning, though. Uh, here in king g7. I think I am. I think I am. I think I'm in an h7, an h7 king h6. I was so I I definitely not don't regret the decision to go bishop e6, uh, and I just promote king g5, king f4, king e3. His checks run out. Queen g7, queen g5, queen d6, queen here, rook here, and uh, checkmate on the rim cannot serve the bank. That's a huge win. Let's go. That's so huge. So so huge. Nice. It's a really, really important game. Let's see who I'll get next. So perhaps I may stay to in top three. Play in Sizafu. All right, I need to play quick because Bell Bell berserks usually. And if he wins, he gets three points and I get two. And he has quicker games. So I gotta like, don't think at all. Just just go, just go, just play. Just pre-move almost everything. Gotta be careful to not get pre-move trapped. Uh, cheap out. As chess players call it. Uh, so bishop by queen e5. Let's go. Let's develop. Knight here. Mm, here. Queen b6. Let's see. Let's see. Gotta play quickly. Let's go. Rook fb8. Here I think knight e4 works. Bishop c3 id and bishop e1 id. Yes. Oh, I blundered! You can take with this knight. I blundered. But okay. I have f5. Fortunately for me, I guess I still lost a pawn, but fortunately for me, I don't I didn't lose it because I have queen a2 as well. So like the, the, yeah, that's definitely good. And I actually won one pawn because I have queen b3. That is really really nice. And I won second pawn. So from being a pawn down in, uh, to being two pawns up in three moves. So I, I took a pawn each move. That is really really good. Uh, let's see let's see what can I do. Let's see. How are you doing, BB? I'm sorry, by the way. For I'm, I'm not sure. Maybe I asked. Uh, I think I'm gonna take a rook a2, and queen e3, there is bishop d4, and rook b8 is impossible because I take. It is, I think, good. So he has to go like. Oh wait, he has queen b5. Uh oh, gotta be careful. Gotta be careful. I was winning against eagle, but then I had to draw. But you drew him. That is huge. You stopped him from fire. But yeah, great job. Anyways, ginger. Great, great job. I think guys, I'm gonna go for something. No, I don't want to go for something because it loses there. Uh, <sighs> da, 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 da. Need to make a move, need to make a move, need to make a move. I gotta think! Legit cannot, like, every second can lose the tournament for me. Oh, I kind of blundered queen bc, but I, luckily for me, I have queen f7. Yeah, I'm like throwing this game, 
But luckily for me, I have some retreatments which save me. Okay, king of seven, that is huge. I was straight winning, it hurts so much. Yeah, that hurts. But still, good job by drawing ego. Not many people did. Let's go, bishop d4, 95. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Uh, two points up, I want to push these juicers. Let's go. Uh, so knight d3, c4, idea to trade rooks rook a1 and push c3, c2, c1. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Knight if okay, here. Uh, think I gotta push? No, am I throwing a little bit? I might, I might, I might, I might be strong. Ah, uh, I'll trade. He has bishop d6 at the end of the line, but then like rook e2. Well, that is huge. That is huge, that is huge. I have c3 and c2 and then I promote, I think. He has bishop d6, but then c2. He didn't find bishop 6 and now let me be careful. Ah, uh, mm, king e8, I think, and like king d8, e5, bishop b2, I'm not sure. Mm, e5? Mm, king d7. It's really hard. This, I'm wasting so much of very very valuable time that is so so bad because of oh i had c1 i missed a very easy way to win it doesn't work now let's go d5 yeah i wasted so much time winning trying to win this game i could already probably win another game oh man but okay it happens uh let's go c1 and now rook h2 and then yes takes and now i gotta be careful to not blunder my rook and then made my opponent with kin and rook. Uh, okay, another name sees for heroes. Let's go, that's huge. I'm actually top two now. Oh my goodness. Ah, uh, I'm top two. No, I'm not top two anymore. I'm playing against wings. Oh no. That's gonna hurt. That's gonna be awful. Uh oh, uh oh. That is gonna be very, very. Oh no, I'm not playing against wings. That's huge as well. Ooh, I'm not playing wings. That is so important because wings would probably crush me. Oh, lost to a 7100. <laughs> Man, this person got a 7100. That's insane. <laughs> Good job, Man, this person. Yeah, Diego versus Marta. It's one is first. Oh. Okay, let's see. Give me open it, please, Leechess. I cannot. Can you give me Bell? Can you give me Bell? If I get Bell, I'm happy. If I get Bell, I'm so happy. Please, Bell. Please, Bell. Please, Leechess. Give me Bell. Give me him. It's the only one I want to play against. Otherwise, I think I may lose my top two. My top three. Top two is not even close. Give me my, please, give me somebody anyways. Just give me somebody, leeches. <laughs> oh, no. Give me somebody, I'm waiting for a minute. Help. Somebody give me an opponent. <laughs> oh, no. What is going on? We're going to get an opening for a minute. Uh-oh. And against Bell. Yes, it's so huge. The chest is paid, exactly. But I got Bell. Jeff Welter, Jeff Fu, H Alter WM. Welcome to the team. So I can now just slowly, peacefully, relaxingly play because Bell is the one I couldn't let slip. Because Bell, if, if he would win, he still can win. So that's why it should take my time. I'll play Rook C1. Uh, yeah, that is huge. That is so huge that I got Bell. Otherwise, he would probably win somebody with Zerg, and then he could maybe even beat somebody else. So he could maybe get two wins as, with Burst. Uh, but now I'm gonna just slowly play, take my time because I can, because I didn't Zerg. I'm top three already. I'm fine with everything. So yeah, knight c8, queen a7. Okay, just enjoy life. Talk about weather with chat, you know? Just, just enjoy life, enjoy the stream. Uh, oh, it's a huge pawn, actually. Uh, Bishop H, no, wait a second. Is, is this good from him? That he's trying to make the positions very crazy. I think I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna take once, and then take it and take D6. I think that's the best. He has FC, but then after Bishop H1, somehow I'm like, leaves. I have like my bishop and my king has no space at all. Uh, but I think I should survive. Queen e6, straighten the queens off. Bishop f3, he cannot take. Because he still takes, and I'm winning. And then bell, bell, q2. That's the hugest win I could have ever wished for in this tournament. That is the most important game in the tournament. And I won it. That's huge. Good game. Can I get wins, please? No, wins is playing against Manus Purse. Alright, can I get just somebody? I just need a huge quick win. Give me opponent. Give me opponent. Give me opponent. Hey, hey. Give me opponent, eh? Hey, give me opponent, eh? Hey, give me opponent. Oh no, but this first blundered. Okay, I cannot get top two. But I can get against wings. Oh my goodness, that's so intense. So the bangle. 
<laughs> so Domingo may not get top one actually. What is going on? Someone wins. Thank you, thank you. Oh! Oh, so Domingo, you got so lucky. The parents closed. That's so crazy. Oh. One of your wings with a crazy, crazy result. GG, Pseudo Benko, though. Oh my goodness, that was so close. Wow. That's a, well, that was such a stacked tournament. Thanks, everybody, for participating. Yep, of course. Thank you all for the games. Congrats to Kenwaster Pseudo Benko and to Wings of Eagle. Fun time. Should I make another arena? Yeah, maybe you can make it. One of the closest followers arena ever. Exactly! That was so close. I want to see your face win so badly. Same! Same, exactly! At least my performance impressed you sounds Good job! Good job, Ginger is love. Ooh, I can finally embrace the tournament is over. Now, the, like, the most... Uh, the pairing I'm most happy about is getting Bell in last round. If he would win the game, he would most likely... And I could probably... Yeah, that was so awful. Would be so awful if I would get Wings and Bell would get somebody easy. He would Zerg, he would win, and I would not win against Wings, and I would just not get top C. Rosen wins a challenge, I want to see it. No, no. GG everyone, yeah, GG everyone. So the tournament doesn't want to end officially. Oh, it did! So first, Game Master Pseudo Benko, second, Wings of Eagle, second, 74 points, and Pseudo Benko, 75. One point difference. Third, me, 68 points. First, fourth, Bell Bell Q2, 62 points. Uh, fifth, Rostam Izal, 36 points. Sixth, Matwa Matwa, 31 points. Seventh, Telemus, 28 points. He was in first for a while. But unfortunately, yeah, he didn't end so well. 8th, Gorem, 0, 8, 28 points. And 9th, Star, 9th Star, 97, 25 points. And 10th, Vampire Rage, 22 points. Whew. And thanks, is up for the follow. Yeah, let me comment. I'll analyze that game. Yeah, yeah sure. Um, thanks, Telemus. Yeah, and good job, Telemus. 23,000 performance, 100 performance. Uh, thanks. Selling moves. Yeah. <sighs> I can breathe. Like, the last 20 minutes were so, so, so tight. That was huge. That was absolutely huge. Fun fact! Did I get the highest performance in the whole tournament? Uh, yeah! I was too good at chess, you know? I lost 20 games. I got the highest performance. Haha! <laughs> How? Oh no, I didn't. Oh, that's huge. I didn't. I, I definitely didn't. I got destroyed by BLG125. Good performance of 3485. Oh my goodness. I, I wasn't even close, let's be honest, guys. I, I mean, I was top two at least. We can actually make a Sima team and kill every. Maybe actually, yeah, that would be cool. Um, Yeah. I need to drink, I need to hydrate. I wasn't hydrated this tournament. <clears throat> so nice to drink after such an intense tournament. So everybody, thanks a lot for participating. Thanks um, to everyone who participated. I hope you all had fun. Oh, oh. Yeah, so we actually got a lot of members to the team. 1180! So soon we can actually have 1200 members tournament. We just had 1100 and soon we can have 1200. That's huge! That's absolutely insane, guys. Oh. Yeah, so let me analyze the game against Sizafu. So, the opening you played very well. Perhaps, yeah, I think Knight of 3 is a little bit better. And then you would go to Benoni kind of stuff, but F3 is definitely a line. I got this B5. Here you have to play A4 and then keep the knight there. Keep the knight there because after knight C3, queen E5, I got the dreamest position of Benko player could ever achieve. Dream of. You'll get your rooks to B and A file. The pawns are weaknesses, white has in castle and I'm good. This 
BC was a mistake, you had to go for knight d1. Yeah, I think BC wasn't a good move. I had knight g4. Ah, that's nasty. Bishop d2, c4, and I would be good. See my game against win, I'd know what I should have done. Yeah, alright, I will, I will, I will, I will. Ah, uh, so yeah, knight g4. Because I played knight e4, and I blundered there is knight g4. I thought I'm winning by the blunt knight g4. My new computer just arrived when the arena, and that's cool, that's cool. Um, so I played f5. Rook c1, you played very well. Rook b1 was a blunder. GG's, yeah, GG's minus 4. GG's to everyone who played. GG's. Huge, 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 huge. Uh, here, that was the biggest blunder, I think, of the game. You had to go for knight d6. After takes, queen e6, queen d7, and you would be fine. Because after rook d5, actually, push up d4, that's so nasty, and queen b1. It would be a rook up. But I played queen d5, I won two pawns. And then slowly, but surely, maybe with some troubles, I went on to win. So yeah, you have to be careful with rook b1. And instead of rook c1, play rook d1. You you got a little bit confused with your rooks. So, yeah. I had performance of 26, 16. Games played 24, win rate 83. Zerk rate of, of course 0. And average rooms rate in 22, 61. Let's see, today I played 24 bullet games plus 20 unrating. Uh, no, wait, we played unrated. 20 wins, 1 draw, and 3 losses. The draws against Matva Matva was a little bit unfortunate. Um, so we got in crazy. Hey, Vaki, how are you doing? G6, a blunder, you go for A6. Because, oh, right, he had 95, 97, it just would be worse. Makes sense. And then really nice maneuver. 95, queen D5. Take, take, 95. Oh gosh, my head hurts from all oh, head hurts from all that screaming. Then he was a fine position. F6 a blunder go for bishop d4. Right, here at bishop b3 with a nice regrouping. And even knight d5 ideas. Hi Peter. Uh this is this. Queen of Ivan, I'd go for rook c7. Yeah, I'd go for rook f7. Queen rook c7. He had queen e7 with rook d7 ideas and taking b7 and he would win a pawn and he would be better he didn't do that though the oh no i went all the way back that's unfortunate this is this skinny chase blunder go for rook c4 and after rook b7 rook a4 f5 rook b8 rook a5 that's a draw king h6 this is this i was lost he had to go for rook b5 because i got rook c and i had to go for rook c5 again and that would be drawn because he had rook b5 protecting the pawn for like that and like g3 can h3 can his skin and it would be better rook 6 was a blind go for g4 he blind the rook but unfortunately for me i had no time left and i decided i have to make the draw it was draw 3 and i'm doing good uh so a6 uh bishop d4 uh rook c7 rook c4 rook c5 rook d5 and rook a6 no it wasn't rook a6 huh it was rook b6 very very big difference you know guys uh yeah definitely not <laughs> all right bishop b3 uh queen e7 ah, my head hurts it legit hurts from all that screaming all this intense intense nervous gameplay help g4 okay now let's analyze the games i lost uh, one to build g125 then Batik 01 and Pseudovenko. He says build g125 like just get demolished. He played 3 0 I played 4 1 1. I played a really bad opening. I didn't know what to play. A5 mistake it for C5 and 96. And he got a crushing attack. Big difference, yeah. This is his. And he was just like <clears throat> a knight and two pawns up. I tried to come back, but he didn't. And my opening played so well. And then here he made me a losing game. Build g125. I'd go for c5 and then knight c6. No, 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 I'd go knight c6. Okay. And for him, nothing. Then it's against bad deck 0 1. That was, uh, that was 2 1 1 for him and 5 1 1 2 for me. I literally cannot speak. That's how I'm still in shock after the tournament. I legit cannot speak. Uh, knight h1 blind, you go for rook f1. Yeah, because I won a pawn. Queen e7 was a blind, you go for rook 45. We better a pawn up because I blunder this and rook e1. It was still drawn. C6 plan to go for G6. He had Queen C8, Queen B7, Queen D5. He would be better. Uh, this is this. And it was drawn. And you need to check my last game with minus pairs. All right. And here, Rook F6 was a blunder. I thought, thank you for the follow. Brian Tyre enjoys, enjoys, thanks for the follow. Enjoy, stay here and have fun. I had to go for, like, Rook B8 or Rook E3 and I would be fine. But yeah, so for four seconds, I played Rook F3. Blunder in Queen E4 and Blunder in the Rook. And I went on losing in Bardic 01. It was so, so, so unfortunate. 
That was really, really painful to lose this game. I wasn't worse for it in it, like for sure. And I saw it for a while, and I made a move which blundered everything away. That was so unfortunate. And in this game was a pseudo Benko. Oh yeah, that was his 4 3 end game. 4 2, two 1 3 for him and nil, nil 4 for me. It was nice opening. I'm glad I'd go for a rook ac8. Because here he just had rook b7 win a pawn. He didn't do it, he played rook fd1. Do you play knight c? I'm not sure. I'll check it. This is, and we got into 4 3 rook end game. Look at graph. Yeah, the graph was so equal. It was so, so equal. I, I just didn't have enough time to hold it. We played for like 20 million moves. I played like literally the best moves. And then g5 was a blunder. I'd go for king f7. Yeah, I made an impulsive move. I'd go king f7, king e6. It would be drawn. This is this. Mm, I was totally winning here to go for rook e2. Just wait. And after king g6. I think rook e6, king f7, king f5 is winning. Rook e7, this is a winning, winning endgame. Uh, in the whole... Ah, okay, cool, Manus Purse, yeah. And otherwise, I'm just lost. He played rook f5, then he was draw. Then I offered a rook trade, I mean, I had a second left. I'd go for rook c1, and here he didn't want to win with f6. He went king e5, and then here I got brutally flagged by... Can was a pseudo-banko, but yeah, it was a fun game overall. Um, it was really, really unfortunate that I was very, very slow. But yeah, he played extremely fast, and that's what he got. He got a win for that. King e7. Rook b7, rook e2, or rook e1, or rook e3. No, both work, and all work. And king f6. Two skyscrapers. Exactly. <laughs> yeah, skyscraper. Actually, like three. One just started building, but then it got cut off. Yeah, that was like a small little village hut right here. Then it was like plain, plain, then skyscraper, and skyscraper, and then skyscraper got building, but then the building got cut off very quickly. Um, so it's a nice, the best game of Soda Banco. I mean, I guess I did against me already. <laughs> but uh, did he win against Wings? Hmm. actually get some crazy opening six of me and wings in one game. Yeah, I think I'll analyze Pseudo's game very in-depth. I'm not sure what to analyze. I guess the instant is and all that. I have to go. I right, take your ginger slap. No, I'll analyze your game real quick. Wait, can you stay for like a second? Can you stay for like a second? I'll analyze your game against uh I analyze your game against wings real quick, real quick, really quickly. So dressless chess or ginger slap on Twitch was playing against wings of eagle. Um, I won a pawn, but then he got a very nice position with his d5 move. Uh, please, my game, yeah, 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 I'll analyze it. Knight b5 with knight c7 idea. This is this, he was winning, but then he blundered. I mean, it wasn't really a blunder, I guess, but like, he, he has a rook for two knights and two pawns. That's not the best ratio, but then he got the material back. Thank you for the follow. Uh, Yoto Goto. Thank you, enjoy staying here on a fun. Vince was winning a rook endgame, rook a4, king of 8, he was winning, but Vince threw a little bit, and then uh, Ginger got nice position here, high oracle of it, here Wings played f5, he'd go for e5, and then, then f5 he would be winning, after f5 he missed a really important move, f4 fixing the pawns, and h6 this, King d6, and he was totally winning for the, uh, Ginger, and then he had a queen, but then unfortunately, really, really, really unfortunately, he didn't manage to win the... Oh! Ginger is love! Yesterday! Yesterday I gave... You remember, I'm not sure if you were in the stream, but I gave you guys a position which transformed into this, some sort of queen endgame like that. Like, literally the same exact position, only the reverse colors. And you were winning here, but unfortunately there was a draw, and then yeah, it ended in a draw. Yeah, I remember. Yeah, that was a very, very cool game though. Really, really well played. Let's see. Let's see. Wings game against Pseudo Banco, I guess. I'm sure I like this one more. Time pressure, yeah, yeah. I'm not sure which was cleaner. This felt like Banco was fine, but then he blundered. Uh, yeah, that felt good. Yeah, one nil one from Wings, and not bad from Be uh, Benko as well. Four one one. So this is this. C five. It was a very very drawn. H was a blunder. Wings had to go for Knight of C. Yeah, because Benko here at ninety four winning a pawn. So take care, Ginger Slav. Thanks for playing in the tournament. Hope you had fun. 
Uh, this is this. It was a draw, but then here Benko blundered. Yeah, he had to go queen b3. Uh, high sir, can I play? No, I mean you can save up champ points, but I'm not playing against everyone. Why did Mitwins place like one x? <laughs> Due to Benko wins this arena is so hot. Yeah, that 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 was a stacked arena ever. Like that was most stacked arena I've ever created. So many strong players. That was insane. So yeah. Benko had to take, but he didn't, and then she blundered knight, and then Wings won the game. Cool, analyze Pseudo's game already. Let's see. Bell was watching the stream. I will analyze his game again. I don't know. Uh, Rostam, that was a good game, I think. I respect his play. Yeah, he played very well. Let's see. Bozert, and then Bell Bell got. Oh, it was. Yeah, Bell Bell. Well, well, yeah, take care. Take care, Ginger Stuff. You're so energetic. Thanks for having, creating cool, strong team. Yeah, thanks for creating the vibe as well. Take care. So, um, Bell Bell won a... All right, I'm going to analyze the game against Alberto Telmos. Then, Bell Bell won a knight. <clears throat> Maybe it was a little shaky, but then King of 7, Rook 8, that was brilliant! And Knight of 4, that was so stunning. You could have taken the queen, actually, but he didn't, because he said, I have an attack. The attack is better than the queen. And then he... Yeah. Oh, Chris Pat took Pratt. Nice. Maha. And then... That was a really great game from Bell. Bell. Q2. Let's see. Telemos against Alberto. That was the first one. Woo! Sheesh! 15 blunders, 12 blunders. That's insane. BF Karma needed two or three warm-up games. Cup. <coughs> uh, but then he unleashed a powerful strike. <laughs> he also had to warm up. For me, first seven games were a warm up, and then I played quite well chess, quite good chess. Sheesh, yeah. I think I played that many blunders in one game in my life. Yeah, that's a lot of blunders. That's quite a lot. So, ah, speed running, weepy. Okay, tell me, yeah, that was good. Then, then yeah, you were winning, but yeah, you didn't win a win, and you flood your opponent with point seven. Great game. Really great. <laughs> speed running. I speed run the analysis, guys. I speed run. No, just kidding. Now let's analyze it normally. So, Telemus, yeah, he, I think, maybe tried to pre move trap. Ah, uh, no. <laughs> Alright. He blundered a pawn, but then he got a nice position. This is it. He played against Alberto Chess and that 2300 rated. Um, this is Rook D2. Because, yeah, now Rook D1, you were slightly worse, but then really, 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 really nice checks pattern, and then you got a pawn, this is this, you were worse. Yeah, Bishop D4, your knight was stuck, if you protect the knight, then uh, Bishop A7. So, but your opponent didn't do this, Bishop B3, Bishop C5, you got your knight well, and then your opponent went for the opposite color, Bishop Endgame. Chosen good, yeah, king g5, then like king, it's really hard to win, not gonna lie. You played human moves, you bring your king there, you are three pawns up, this is this, and then nice pre-move trap, nice little cheap a 5 a 4 then you're totally winning, you got four extra pawns, here, yeah, just stay, but it's time trouble, that was insane, this, 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 yeah, take the bishop, but it's so impossible to do with one second, and then with points seven. Telemus flagged his open. That was an insane game, Telemus. Really, really nice. You played very well. Most of the blunders were in time trouble, actually. So, otherwise, you played it really, really well. Mm -hmm. The Vampire Rage. Uh, let's see. I should speed life. Perhaps. So, it was. It looked very cool, at least the ending. Bishop e2 trading, yeah, he's open and third. This is this c4. Oh, really nice tactic, we need pawn. This, 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 and then look, guys, Vampire Rage saw the weakness. He won the weakness and he won the queen, and then he won the game. That was brilliant. That was brilliant, Vampire Rage. If you're watching this stream, great, great game. Really big respect. Pseudobanko against Ray. Rain Zola, let's analyze this game. It was interesting. Ah, uh, yeah, I saw this game, right? So Benko won a pawn. This is his. And then he won second pawn. And he was totally winning. He's opening dim financing. Nice three queen of two. That was a brilliant, brilliant game as well. Very, very clean. Not giving his opening any chances. Let's see second page. 
Dressless Chess analyzed his game against Wings. Yep, I did. Uh, analyzed Shizafu. Ah, uh, la la la. 3100 even played in this tournament, which is insane. Man is first playing in 3100. It's huge. Um, let's see. Then we have Puki11. He won against... Uh, Whoa! He won his NGM Umut Crazy 2000 almost. Pookie, great job if you're watching. So it was some sort of Catalan kind of stuff. A5, A4. Nice. Yeah, I'm Rook E6, Rook B6. You better not do it. And Rook B2. But you activated your Rook, which was nice. 95 B6. And actually, out of nothing, I think Bishop A6 A would be better. Funnily enough. Funnily enough, yeah, you suck an exchange, but then you get it back, 95, and it's some sort of French kind of stuff, bishop d2 and 85, you're better. Really, really cool. You played rook b5, and anyways, oopsie, what? Oh yeah, bishop a4, bishop a4, bishop c1, your rook is trapped. Uh, but this, you could have taken the queen, this, 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 and you open blind the queen. That was a very interesting game, Puke. Maybe not the most cleanest one, but it was very def definitely very, very interesting and aggressive. A man wanted to analyze the game against whom? I forgot. Man who did you analyze the game against? I analyzed uh, Karmar's game in, no, Johnny D's game in while against NGIM Umut Crazy as well. So Johnny D played a nice little game with London structure and he won a piece very quickly. That was very nice. And then he won a rook. Well, he won an exchange, but he was a whole rook up because he was a knight up already and he won a queen and he won another rook. What a brilliant game that was from Juni D. That was insane. Manuspurs, what game do you want me to analyze? And Karma is a game against Manuspurs. Let's see. Karma played 2 nil nil. Guys, we gotta check Karma. That was way too clean. That's too clean. 2 nil nil is very, very sus. We gotta check him. Maybe he's a sussy buck, huh? You choose. I had many good games that I lost. Well, did you love some game particularly? Now enjoy this. All right. So Karma playing against Manius versus Mitten to sound two on Lichas. This Queen of C three E six. Really nice opening. I love it. Then Manius first had to go for Bishop D two. He now he had to take. Still would be a really unpleasant position, but I don't remember which one. So all right. But he played Knight C four. Oh my goodness! C takes B. Karma, your daily puzzle paid off. That's a brilliant puzzles kind of stuff. Wow! C takes B, and if knight takes queen, you take the rook, and then there is a second queen. That is magnificent. Magnus please played queen c3, and Kama took, then he promoted second queen. He blundered this queen. We don't talk about that, but Magnus first played king of 3 didn't take that queen. And this and the threat. Brilliant game? Be careful with blundering your queen. Don't play queen b2. But a really nice game. Maybe first game with K. All right. Yeah, great game. Karmara and good game, Manus Purse. Let's analyze um, Manus Purse first game against Karmar. Let's see. Meanwhile, let's analyze Quetaval or Zalmai on Twitch, which is a popular cough. <laughs> Could have saved it. Yeah. Mm. But that was a clean game from Manus Purse. 95 accuracy. But even if I took it, it was still plus 7.9, not too much. So Catalan, good play from the opener from both players. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. And then it feels like Karma Oh Karma Blunder a piece. But and then a queen. Oh Bodus Gambit. Bodus Gambit accepted. And Manuspurs took everything. He took a queen, three pawns. He started to run away, but he did. This is this. Then he took, uh, oh my goodness, how many pawns did you take, Manius first? <laughs> how many pawns did you take? Wow, seven, uh, seven, seven pawns, and then a queen as well. Oh, poor Karmar, poor Karmar's skin. And then Manius first took the rock and it mated. Wow, that was my warm-up game. But gosh, seven pawns, a rook and a queen for Manius first, plus 21 material points. That is insane. That is insane, but yeah, good job, good job, guys. It was a nice game. Uh, I'm gonna unpin the link to the tournament. And yeah, I'm gonna analyze Zalmai's game. And I'm gonna end the stream. Close, pow, kachikau, kachikachu, unpin this message. Unpin this message, unpinned. Nice. So, Quetawal or Zalmai was playing against Schlaffen, Schlaffen, 615 and 317. Uh, let's see. So it was like pretty and nimzo-ish kind of stuff. 
Bishop b5 here, you could have taken a pawn, he didn't see it. Still, he got a nice position. Knight e3 blunder. Oh, right, nice, knight e2. And the queen has to move, you take the knight, and that's why I said take the queen. Really nice tactic. Rook f2. Uh, Zalma got a worse position, he blunder in exchange. Uh, he was kind of lost, the queen's got over the board. Rook f3 blunder. He's open out to take. All right, king of six, and then like rook b1, this and perpetual. So say he's opening goes rook f2, there is rook b1, rook a2, rook b8, this check, and that's a draw. And rook a3 is this, is it, that's a draw, anyways. He missed that. But then he's open played rook g7, give him chance to play rook c1, taking the pawn once again. He didn't do that. f4. Now he took the pawn, and now he's open in time trouble, literally self mated himself. Look, e3, g6, rook g7. And Zalmai didn't take the rook, he checked and then mated with the pawn. That's a brilliant game. That was a really nice game. And that is, I think, everybody who, yeah, watches the stream quite regularly. Um, wait, did I lose Vampire Rage's game? I didn't, did I? No, I did against Star Show Speed Live. So that's everybody. 46 players, that's huge. Thanks everybody for participating. That is everybody who, if you took, okay, cool. That is everybody who has played in the tournament. And I think I'll slowly wrap things up. I really hope you enjoyed the stream. Uh, I'm probably, guys, who do I rate? I think I'm gonna rate Lefong. Uh, he just started the stream, so some extra viewers for him wouldn't be extra. Everybody, thanks all for watching. Thanks all to BMAP Sorty for 50 months at tier one uh, for the sub. Then Jay Hollow for two months at tier one. And Pseudo Chess with Prime thing. And a lot of followers as well. So, nearing eight, next goal. Okay, left one, yeah. Next goal, 8.5k followers. We also got like 30 people to the team. We are like at 1954 night. We are 1979. 25, that's huge. Take care, everybody. Thanks all for watching. Bye, Telus. Bye, Darko. Bye, Karma. Bye, Manu Spurs. Bye, Tubletchik. Bye, Rezan. Bye. Bye, Yo to go to. Bye, Ginger Slav. Bye, Darko. Bye, Oracle and Vid. Bye, Peter. Bye. Uh, bye, 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 Rezan. Bye, Sizafo. Bye, J Hollow. Bye, my Be Me Absonti. Bye, Pseudo Chess. Bye, Leonti Trip. Five. Bye. Bye, 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 everybody. Congrats to the second and first place to. Wings on Eagle and right and Pseudo Banco, Pseudo Chess on Twitch. Gosh, let me see. Uh, la 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 la. J Hollow, yes, yes, yes. Oshla Papa, one, two, three. Uh, Self Service, Wizard. Uh, and that's everybody. Who are you loaded? So, everybody, thanks a lot for playing. I really hope you had fun and I hope you had fun, fun Thursday. We had like 70 viewers at peak. We still have 30. Join the Discord if you want to. If you don't want to miss the next streams. Uh, so take care, everybody. Thanks a lot for watching. Really hope you have fun and have fun in the tournament. Have fun watching. Thanks a lot for watching. Take care, everybody, and bye bye.